and the city's a proud sponsor of this parade. Uh, we, you know, we were one of the first ones to step up and say, let's do it. It's gotten bigger and bigger, and I think what it says about this community in particular is that we're a place that honors that diversity, that celebrates it, that uh, shares in everyone's successes, regardless of the God you worship or who you love. That's who we are, and we're proud of it. I've been at every parade, haven't missed one. Um, I will be there throwing beads and reveling in, uh, in another amazing Tampa Day. So you say this is human Your heartbeat versus mine I'm in chains cause I'm choosing Showing love for living life I shouldn't have to leave where I stand I shouldn't have to change who I am To count as a human but I'm standing next to the hottest guy at Tampa Pride, Steve Grand. Welcome, Steve. Thank you very much. We're not making ourselves cooler by holding on to each other, but we're spreading the love. That's what we're all about here. That's right. Tampa Pride is all about love. And Steve Grand, this year, was one of our Grand Marshals. Every year since its revival in 2015, Tampa Pride has attracted hundreds of parade entries and tens of thousands of enthusiastic participants. The parade brings vitality and excitement to the streets of Ebor. Taking safe sex to the extreme here. I mean, this is like the most full-body condom you could come up with. It is. So, what's this all about? We just have to promote safe sex. It's just people take it for granted. I wish I could reach them. Strip away or separate uh, It's the same air we're breathing Same tears run down our face So I don't have to leave where I stand And I don't have to change who I am To count as a human uh, I will never leave Tampa I've, I've had offers for different jobs in law enforcement elsewhere I was born and raised in Tampa. My family lives here. My kids were raised here. I will never leave Tampa. Tampa Pride's parade also showcases the talents of numerous marching bands, including the Tampa Pride Band, the Righteously Outrageous Twirling Corps, and the Plant High School Marching Band. Local crews and service organizations join politicians, businesses, and church groups in this festive event. So I think uh, our community, you know, in the times of tragedy, we've been able to come together, and that's an important thing, especially with the uncertainty and the unrest that's going on in our community and country today. Um, the whole concept of unity that pride brings, I think, is so important. That's one of the things that we need to keep as our thing. You know, just uh, how my, my parents raised me, you know, especially my mother. She had so many gay friends growing up, different era, the disco era. So, you know, I mean, I, I was surrounded with people that, that we're not just, you know, not so much pro-equality, but, you know, pro-love. And uh, to just be accepting of folks, and everyone has a right to be happy. And Entertainment abounds at Tampa Pride, with two outdoor stages featuring national and local performers amid the peaceful revelry of the day-long celebration. An impressive vendor marketplace connects the community with supportive businesses, charitable organizations, community leaders, and health care services. Hi everybody, welcome to Tampa Pride. It's just about to get underway. It's rocking and rolling here. We have a sound stage over here going on this side. We have Mary's stage going on that side. The parade starts at, at, at 12.30 here. Then, Pride for Adults takes over and Ybor City becomes fabulously gay from one end to the other. So, hurry on down and enjoy Tampa Pride. TampaPride.org.